all my life, been grinding all my life. Sacrifice, hustle, pay the price. Wanna slice, got to roll the dice. That's why all my life, I've been grinding all my life. My name is Elliot Kipsang. Uh, we just here today to just ride easy miles. Uh, yesterday we had real workout. Today is just only to drop something like 10 miles easy. No, like 630 pace. Slowly, slowly. Yeah, you can be the greatest. You can be the best. You can be the King Kong banging on your chest. You can beat the world. You can beat the war. You can talk the guy go banging on his door. You can throw your hands up. You can beat the clock. Yeah. You can move a mountain. You can break rocks. You can be a master. Don't wait for luck. Dedicate yourself and you go find yourself. Standing in the Hall of Fame. Yeah. And the world's gonna know your name. You can run the mile You can walk straight through hell with a smile You could be the hero You could get the gold Breaking all the records They thought never could be broke Yeah, do it for your people Do it for your pride And you're ever gonna know If you never even try Do it for your country Do it for your name Cause there's gonna be a day When you're standing in the Hall of Fame yeah. And the world's gonna know your name I'm from Kenya, uh, Eldoret particularly. Yeah, I was born there, raised, and uh, yeah, I came to America like 2019 when I decided like to just come for school to join a scholarship thing. And since that day, it's uh, like everything has been fine, you know, it's been fine in America. I look at America, it's like it's like a home for me now. It's been like, yeah, like three years now and everything is going on smooth uh, and I'm planning to stay here the best American food I like is mac and cheese nothing will beat mac and cheese <laughs> delicious <laughs> I just want to be like Olympic champion like I just want to leave my legacy in this world like I once I was an Olympic champion you know inspire like young generation to come like I want to be like Eliud Kipsang or King of Track you know I think that's the best thing and it's my dream so the name King of Track where it came from it came from from, from the the first year I got here I was not in good shape then I went to Birmingham I raced a mile and I raced like 409 yeah then that was the time I was like if I came here and I raced 409, why was that the name? Nobody doesn't know. I say, hmm, let me just put King of Track. And now King of Track is like a big, big real deal in, in America, right? even Kenya. Every people likes it. I usually listen like, you know, reggae? Yeah. <laughs> that's my the best. Like it has something like it's so, that's that mood, you know? Yeah. Slowly warming up. Getting your body like to be like no stress. Don't talk to anybody, just listen. Reggae. <laughs> I love reggae a lot. I was about to join Ambe before I started like be a runner in Kenya. Like that was the only thing I could have just do. But I think it was the best decision for me running. I think this is my favorite road right here. Snake bites it's so nice. So flat. Just running slowly, you know. It doesn't bother you, like you don't have to climb the hills or hill paths, but it's fine. Eh? Enjoying the environment. Green trees everywhere. Go hard or suffer. <laughs> or train hard or, or suffer. I think I got it from Chelimo. Paul Chelimo said that thing and I was like, oh, it's kind of like, it's true. Go hard or suffer. Like, if you, if you don't train hard, I mean, you'll suffer. 
you'll, you'll just be beaten by everyone. So nice out here. I'm, I'm a social guy though. Like I'm the guy who like, uh, when I meet with people like, we, I give them motivation. You know, that's why you, you'll be seeing like a lot of people like, they're just rooting for me. Even if I lose it, they will still, you know, they are still there at my back, you know. I like my fans. <laughs> I like Alabama because it's not snowing. I hate snow. Well, I don't like being being cold like that. Snow is so bad. I spent like almost, even when I'm in class, I'll be in TikTok. I just like love it, you know. Make myself happy in there. I post my running stuff, you know. I post like a uh, treadmill workout, you know. I think I'm a king of treadmill again. If you go see in my, tra my TikTok, you'll see three, four to five bits. Who can hold it? <laughs> when, I was going, when I was going to that meet, I was like, okay, whatever happens, it will happen. Let me just go inside. So my coach told me like, you gotta believe yourself. You know, at first time I didn't believe myself. Like I'm going to run that. You know, first race since disappointing indoor season. <clears throat> Then I went there. I was feeling good, like strong, able to like just put the power down, swing my my hands good, swing my legs. And then the last 300, someone shout from like outside the truck, like you are in record. I was like, oh, kind of. Then. At that time now from two, like 200 I start kicking that's why you see me I got that kick and when I was like five meters in the, in the line so that's why that's the time you see me having that expression I was like oh. <laughs> and I say yes I did it and it was so funny I want to still race Coloca right now I want that guy you beat me national, I wanna beat your ass. <laughs> he knows me good. I mean, it's gonna be a great race, you know. Whoever wins, that's what's up. <laughs> the average for today was like 6.25 per mile, you know. Fun run, stay smooth and all the way and just take care of the heart rate to not go up. And chill on it, you know. It was fine. I like that 10 miles. I've never enjoyed 10 miles like this one today. <laughs> it was kind of good. Thanks for watching guys. Oh, make sure you like, comment and subscribe to this channel.